Hello again. So I want to show you how to create a folder in your Google Drive, put things in there and take things from there. All right. So when you are signed into your Google account, your 1Password gets you into all of the Google apps. Okay. So if you're a Frontier teacher, you have uh, Google apps already ready to go for you. You have a Google Drive. Things have been being shared to your Google Drive already. And I'll show you what I mean. So if you click on this right here, this little icon showing nine tiles, that's your Google Apps, and click on Drive. That might not be in the exact same place for you. If you don't see it there, scroll down for more, okay? So Google Drive looks like this. When you get into Google Drive, you're going to see, just like any, um, any hard drive, all right? You have folders here. Now, I already created one for my website. Okay, but we're going to create a new one now. So we're going to click on New, Folder. And then we're going to type mrpanfill.com. All right, it might not let me use the dot. I'll just keep it Mr. Panfill Website and Create. Now, in there, double click on it, it opens up that folder. I'm going to create a new one just because. I'm going to create a new folder called images. That way I'm keeping things separate. Now, double click inside your images folder and any images you have, you can drop here. You can just drag them and drop them directly into this spot. It'll upload them automatically for you. Otherwise, you select new file upload and then find where they are. Okay, so if you keep them on your desktop, you open them here. If you keep them in your documents folder, you open them here. You click it and you click open and it'll start uploading it for you. Okay, now this is a movie, but it's still going very fast. Now you have all of your things saved in your Google Drive at home. If you want to work on your website at home, you can sign into your Google Drive. Everything is there. You don't need a thumb drive. If you sign into a different computer at school, it's right there, already for you. So that's setting up a folder on your Google Drive.